up YouTube? Your buddy Warbeard here with something different for y'all. I'm gonna be doing gear reviews now. I'll be issuing those out on every Monday. So keep an eye out for those. For starters, I'm gonna be reviewing the Viking Cycles riding vest. Pictured here and here. Now this riding vest, it has pockets fucking galore. It's a textile vest. Uh, it comes with a back pad. I suggest replacing that back pad for sure with uh, something that is D3O. No doubt about that. Uh, yeah, green light. I would also uh, suggest, I ordered a size large. I usually wear a size large in all my riding jackets, except for, you know, European cuts, just American cut jackets. This this uh, riding vest is supposed to be worn over a jacket. That's what it's intended for. The cuts on those the sides and on the neck, it's obviously supposed to be worn over a riding jacket of some sort or other sweater jacket of any type. I ordered a size large. It is big on me. I have it all the way cinched down on the sides as far as I can go. It's still pretty big. I would size down when you order it. I ordered mine off Amazon. You can order yours off of uh, motorcyclehouse.com or amazon.com. If you have Prime, it's a hell of a lot faster. So I would uh, get a size down if you're intent on wearing it during the hotter months. You know, get a medium because I'm a large. You know, that away you're. <laughs> Sucker. Fucker died. There we go. <laughs> so I would size it down. It's a nice jacket, lots of pockets, has a cell phone pocket, two pockets on each side out front, two on the top inside. And has little pockets for pens or lighters or whatever you want to keep in there. Overall, for the price, $49.99 off Amazon.com. It's well worth the money that you spend for it. it you know, it's a nice, lightweight, comfortable vest. I'll have the link down below to this vest off Amazon.com that I went and I shopped on. I hope you all like it as much as I do. Peace.